Let me, show, let me show you this. Here's what's happening out there, right? It's kind of interesting. The studio's kind of ready to roll for this special yes, we're sir. doing tonight. You know, you guys are all, man, there's like hundreds of people wandering around here. It's going to be a great uh, election coverage tonight here on WFA and on our digital side as well. You might sure you want to check that out. High today was 80. The morning low is 57. 57, the morning low. The normal low is 45. The normal high is 45. We'll be closer to normal as we head uh, into and through this upcoming weekend. So enjoy the relatively warm temps. No records right now, but the relatively warm temps because big cool down for Saturday and Sunday. 71 outside right now with the north northeast wind at 17. Juniper, oak, both high, hack is moderate and fungus today is low. Have you seen the towering cumulus outside right now? The cumulonimbus clouds that we have here in, uh, looking anywhere from across really Dallas County, parts of Collin County as well. Certainly a Kaufman County, Rockwall County and Hunt County. You can see this towering thunderstorms that are down here to the to the southeast, far southeastern corner of Dallas County right now, south of Seagaville, just off to the west of you and Scurry. That's a little thunderstorm. It's not severe, but a little thunder, a little lightning with that, of course. Same thing up around Roy City right here on the Hunt, Rockwall County, kind of Collin County line here, right where all three come together. South of Josephine, just outside of Roy City, little thunderstorm. Cumbie's picking up a little bit of rain. This stuff won't last long. I mean, it all fizzles out as we head through the next couple of hours. And there we are at 8, then poof, it's just gone. And then we're dry overnight. Here's 7 tomorrow morning. Sunshine, clouds start to roll in during the day, but a dry day. There's a little rain as we head through Wednesday evening. Now 30% of us will pick up some rain Wednesday evening. Maybe there's some quarter size hail. Maybe there's some gusty winds with any thunderstorm. That's all possible Wednesday evening. Midnight, Wednesday night, there's a little bit of rain. There's Thursday morning. And I have rain in my forecast Thursday. 60, 70% of us see rain on Thursday. That means 40, you know, 30, 40% of us don't see any at all. Noon on Thursday, 3 p.m. on Thursday. Pretty strong cap in place, but we still have that rain coverage around as we head through Thursday. And we do have a chance of some more quarter size hail, maybe some gusty winds. We go from a level one severe weather threat to a level two severe weather threat on Thursday. I can't rule it out at any time during the day, but especially the afternoon and Thursday evening. Then here's Thursday night, 11 o'clock. <clears throat> Watch this three in the morning, Friday morning. Here's five in the morning, Friday morning, 7 a.m. on Friday. That system then moves out and then we dry out as we head through uh, Friday afternoon, certainly dry as we head through the weekend. Uh, that little bit of rain, it begins Wednesday night, Thursday, Thursday night, and Friday morning. We could see a half an inch to an inch, lower amounts to the east, higher amounts, uh, higher amounts in east Texas, lower amounts west of Fort Worth. There's that rain coverage. It's Wednesday night through Friday morning. We're dry tomorrow during the day, and we're dry Saturday and Sunday as well. Tonight, 54, a few clouds, a couple degrees cooler tonight than last night. Any little rain that's out there now ends in the next couple of hours. And then tomorrow, dry, warm, light winds, a high tomorrow of 80 degrees. The next 14 days, there's a little bit of rain on Thursday and Friday. And then we have uh, another little chance of rain as we head through the uh, end of next week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and even Sunday. So, and Cynthia, come on over here. We're going back on live television. Oh, you're on the right side of me. This makes me very uncomfortable. Uh, time change this coming weekend and then the following weekend at St. Patrick's Day. You're touching me, Cynthia, and you have 15 <laughs> minutes to stop. Yeah, HR is already on the way down, just so you know. He could only wish. Coming up next, 